I'm surprised I still have a job. Don't be silly. Meridian, at last. Isn't this the best time to be alive? We have a home, and I want to spend every waking minute with you. A toast to the vanquished. How about to Meridian? To dreams. It's my toast, and it's to the vanquished. Hail the Archon Killer. I heard you were amazing. You actually picked a Krogan ambassador. Couldn't be prouder to call you a friend. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I love being on the ship. Sit now, and I'll skip the blood work. I feel a headache coming on. Writer does lead us to interesting places. If you see me spending a ton of time here, please make me leave. This place is great for a jog. I saved a whole cluster. When do I get time off? The galaxy seems a lot friendlier these days. We could get a cozy place for two. You're here. I love surprises. Wait. Krogan children. You're so legend, there was a fight yesterday over who gets to write a song about you. The Nexus is a whole different place. Meridian secure, the Archon beaten. That's a damn good job, Ryder. Picking Morda took guts. I am legendarily busy thanks to you and Morda. No time to rest. Meridian is a signature victory. A Krogan? Empowered? I won't pretend I'm not disappointed. You have a high priority destination. Opening channels to the Nexus. Meridian, Podromos, Deteon, Tevuni, New Pachunka, and Initiative Allies. Habitat 7 is now listed as Rider 1. Your world, Pathfinder. Their future. Where to next? I'm not sure. Honestly, I'm surprised I still have a job. I should probably just retire. <laughs> Don't be silly. We still need you. There's so many outposts that need support. Then let's head out there. Sounds like a brilliant plan. What can I do for you? I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Lexi, I hear Scott's back on his feet. He's hobbling around. Nowhere near ready for the field. Think how much we'll get done with two riders. I can't wait to see Ephra's face when he learns there's another one. Meridian, at last. There's still so much to do. For the Nexus, the Angara... But not today. Today, we get to feel good about winning. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. So? So? <laughs> so? Isn't this the best time to be alive? Yeah, I've decided it is. Or the best time to be awake, as the case may be. No, awake and alive. Because if you weren't here, you'd be dead. Best time to be alive. Yeah, though I don't know how we top this feeling. For now, maybe we don't have to. I'll see you later, Joel. Stay strong and clear. Hello, you. Just wondering what you think of how I'm doing at the job. There's only one metric that matters. We have Meridian. We have a home. And I want to spend every waking minute with you. There's that. We'll talk later. I know it. Toast to the vanquished. The Archon, face down, ass up. So long, bone brain. How about to Meridian? To dreams. 
and family. To whatever's next, may it be beyond our imagination. It's my toast, and it's to the vanquished. You hear that? Hail the Archon Killer. I heard it was touch and go, but you really rose to the occasion. Better to be lucky than good, right? Forget that. Leave nothing to luck. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. Meridian was... mind-blowing, right? I mean, someone didn't bring me where the real action was, but I heard you were amazing. No safety net, no Sam. Didn't bat an eyelash. Eyelashes were the only thing I wasn't batting. Batted the Archon right out of the park. Now, Helios will really take shape, and we have VIP tickets. In some ways, I feel like our adventure is just beginning. How are you getting along with the team? I'm keeping it light and pleasant. Even Lexi isn't exactly what I'd expected. And Chal... I'm learning what makes him tick. We're lucky to have an Angara with us. Asari can mate with all Milky Way species. I find myself wondering if that transcends galactic boundaries. I'm certainly not looking to reproduce anytime soon, but he seems like a good guy. What do you think? You should trust your instincts. Thanks, Ryder. What do you make of Meridian? Are you kidding? It's the single most amazing find ever, and I mean by anyone. The ability not just to terraform planets on a cluster scale, but to create and seed sentient life. The Jardan are the closest thing to gods we've ever touched. It's awe-inspiring. And terrifying. Terrifying how? They were attacked, Ryder, and driven off. The gods have an enemy, and it will also be unlike anything we've seen. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You know it. You actually picked a Krogan ambassador, and Morda even, couldn't be prouder to call you a friend. Wonder what other kind of trouble we can get up to. Always looking for the next fight, aren't you, old man? Gotta admit, old habits die hard. I might have had a long time to settle in. We can talk more later. Sure. Woke up today and thought, back to the search. And then I remembered, it's over. It's really over. We did it. Doesn't mean we can relax. There's still so much to do. Really? And here I was thinking I'd quit. Maybe talk to a Nexus colonization expert. Get assigned to an outpost, start a farm or something. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I love being on the ship. I'm staying here until you kick me off. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. Ready for more tests? Not again. Lexi, I'm fine. Sit now, and I'll skip the blood work. Have you experienced any muscle spasms? Nosebleeds? Memory loss? No, but I feel a headache coming on. Ha ha. Comments like that used to get a rise out of you. I know you too well now. Inhale. <sighs> Exhale. <sighs> You should know. Professor Hirik approached me about a transfer to the Nexus. Apparently my research on Ket anatomy has been useful to the militia. Guess I'll be telling my next doctor about my abandonment issues. I declined. Really? Didn't have a choice. No other doctor in the initiative would take you. You've kept me alive so far. We'll just ignore the fact you died on me. Twice. Three times. No, no, the first time's on Harry. I guess that's fair. Guess you prefer the Tempest to Meridian. Works for me. Well, Ryder does lead us to interesting places. Think there's anywhere more interesting than Meridian? If there is, we'll find out.
realized we haven't decided where we're going to live. You and Sid? Yeah, that was the whole point, wasn't it? A home, putting down roots, new beginnings. <laughs> Sid will probably have some opinions. <laughs> Too many, but you're right. She'll probably want to stay here if I know her, where all the action is. I'm thinking somewhere quiet. Could you handle quiet? I think so. Somewhere on a hill where I can watch a fiery sunset? Yeah, I'd be happy. Ryder, you have to promise me something. What's that? If you see me spending a ton of time here, please make me leave. I could blink and lose 20 years in a place like this. At least I'll know where to find you. Ha ha, very funny. Now go away. I've got more to do and ponder and figure out. What do you want? Something wrong? Oh god, Pathfinder. This is small talk, isn't it? I'm sorry it takes a few moments to turn on my human face. What can I do for you? What have you learned about this world? Have you seen the change in the Remnant ships? They're doing things. They say it's automated maintenance. But... Seven of the larger ships docked on the exterior. Power dimmed. Then they left. We lost them in the Scourge. Pretty tired of surprises. Should we be worried? There was a book I read as a teen. Clark. About first contact. But there was no contact. It was just a ship on its way somewhere else. It made me feel small. That I... and humanity... wasn't the center of everything. It was humbling. But comforting too. The Seven have done the same. But I'm not comforted. This place, Pathfinder, it's still bigger than us. Helios is still bigger. What do you think Meridian needs from me? Your job should be complete. Not to criticize your effort. But by the numbers, we were supposed to be beyond Pathfinders. In fact, we are in spectacular shape. Arc secured, outpost place. Yes, we are approaching normality. Or perhaps normal is at least visible from here. How did you come to the initiative, Yora? Pioneers come in many forms. To be the organizational foundation, the chief of operations on an arc? How could I not come? Plus, I'm rather pleased my colonist ID is D46 Chicago. The number of human chromosomes? My hometown, but that's interesting too. Another time. Of course, Pathfinder. Keeping up your training shouldn't get soft. This place is great for a jog if you follow the equator. Like running up the longest wall in the galaxy. Want to try? I saved a whole cluster. When do I get time off? Sorry, they're calling us heroes. Heroes don't get to sleep in. Ryder, my catalog of remnant signals is off the charts thanks to this place. There isn't anything I won't be able to find out there now. Who is this new PB? Just work, 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 work. Don't count on it, Buster. <sighs> I am so glad I hitched myself to your wagon, so to speak. How's it going? Thank you. For this, quite a gift to all of us. Good to see you. But Meridian is the monument Alec Ryder would want. Pathfinder, name's Jezra. I've set up a little shop to protect your newbie to Frosties. You don't look as wide-eyed as the other Meridian staff. Left with the exiles, came back with the hopeful. You did that. Don't fuck it up. Store's open, Pathfinder. Enjoy. Pathfinder. I'm sure I have something in this jumble that you'd like. Where did you get all this? Everybody brought their rainy day toys to that party you threw. I'm straight out of cryo and right into business. Supply by Cal. I'm here for you. Stay clear, Ryder. Hope. Hope is what built this despite impossible odds. And trust? You took a big chance on us. On me. <laughs> yes, I wouldn't be here seeing this if 
We hadn't opened our minds and hearts to each other. All of us. Even for an Angora, you're one of a kind, Jal. Don't know if I'll ever get used to all the... feelings. <laughs> yes, you will. But only because you must. I've been looking at all the new things that people are building. There is supposedly a store where one can buy... iced cream. Really? Uh, I don't know about that. Maybe? Yeah, I, I wouldn't eat it if I were you. Oh, is it food? I thought it was a body lotion. Always good to see you, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, work continues. It's like shoving an Asari three-prong through a cable, but it continues. Honestly, all this multi-species tech is a real bear to get together. You can't do it? Hell, yes, I can do it. Just making sure the boss knows I'm working hard. What's your story, Hunter Carey? Really, Pathfinder? That's the nice weather we're having of Andromeda. But I'm game. I was in the family business until Grandpa died. After that, all anyone cared about was how to split it up. I can skip uncomfortable Thanksgivings from anywhere. So I came here. Family, right? Sometimes a fresh start is best for everyone. Best for me. And the people I wasn't supposed to hate. I'm here to build something. We all are. Thanks to you. What do you think Meridian needs from me? Not Meridian. All of us. I know about the Sprog Pathfinder. Find that kid, that's the future. What have you learned about this world? I've learned how much I don't know. Logging into these systems is crazy. If your Sam wasn't parked here, I don't know what we'd do. I'm providing everything I can to facilitate integration into the Meridian power structure. Ugh. No word makes a tech pucker like integration. Another time. Pathfinder. Always gonna be work to do, but the galaxy seems a lot friendlier these days. Glad I tied my anchor to your ship. At least that makes one of us old-timer. Old-timer? <laughs> I resemble that remark. So we kicked the Archon's ass, or whatever he had down there. But my people are still roughing it on Elodin. We need to patch things up with the Nexus and figure out why that pet pusher spender still got a job. If we're going to live peacefully out here, the Krogan and Nexus need to work together again. Good, so let's get to work already. You ever just want to fiddle with switches? Ryder, picked a house yet? What are you talking about, Costa? A house. Or apartment, I guess. They're planning the residential conversion. Pathfinder carries some weight. We could get a cozy place for two. Or, you know, more. Plenty of time for picket fences. We'll be flying a while yet. No doubt. But one day, Ryder. One day. We earned it. Ready for more, Pathfinder? Good day, Pathfinder. You'll forgive me if I keep this brief. I am... at capacity. Is that good or bad? Good, of course. We are beginning to deploy the main bays of the Hyperion. Expect to see a lot of new faces. How did you come to the initiative, Darla Vass Hyperion? It is embarrassingly simple. I lived among the Quarians as a child. My parents were ambassadors to the migrant fleet. We lived as they did, in sterile conditions. I had my own enviro suit. I didn't touch soil for a decade. The promise of 600 years on the Hyperion? That wasn't foreboding at all. In fact, it was comforting. I think many would prefer solid ground beneath their feet. But thanks to you, we have both. I am now living in a place that bridges technology and the natural, much like when I was a child. I love Meridian. What do you think Meridian needs from me? Not Meridian. The sleepers. They need opportunity, and that comes from our ability to wake them. You carved a direct line through the Ket, but without resources, without Andromeda viability, we are still scrambling. It remains as it always has, Resources are the key to our future. 
What have you learned about this world? I'm afraid I have turned inward to focus on the Sleepers and our fallen Hyperion. I'm grateful that the Ark remains a part of our future. There's a heart to this vessel, this home. Another time. Esu Salai, Pathfinder. You're here. I'll give you my entire chocolate ration for an interview about Meridian. Done. Down to the ones with strawberry goop in the middle. So, Meridian's real. A promised land. You did it. The Hyperion's a mess, but that crash site does mean humans have a claim to Meridian. We do. It's a big responsibility, but we're ready to tackle it. You're way more direct than Tan. I'm headed out there soon. Documenting Meridian could be a lifetime's work, even for an Asari. I can't wait to get started. Meridian. Now that's history in the making. Everything's reading normal. There's snug as... Oh, hey, Ryder. Harry, what's going on here? You're telling her? Oh, can I watch, please? Of course. Got something to show you. I love surprises. Wait, are those... Krogan children. My children. Live in the egg, every last one of them. Nobody else knows, Ryder. I don't know what's in store for me, but... However this turns out, I'll be part of our future, and so will you. So, does that make me the godparent? Don't let it get to your head. We're going to need more than one. You still have a lot left to give. Guess I do. Hope, it's a scary thing. I'll fight Ryder to protect them, to give them a future. Just like he fought for me. Ryder, you're so legend there was a fight yesterday over who gets to write a song about you. I hear there's a verse about your stalwart and handsome team. That part's me, I'm pretty sure. We did it. Yes, we did. Free drinks for Pathfinders. I'll make sure of it. <sighs> hey there. Alright, I have to admit. The Nexus is a whole different place. There's energy in the air. People of all walks, and Gara teaching what they know. It's kind of great. Our work has changed things for the better. That's for sure. I wouldn't have been got dead here not long ago. Just soaking up all the smarts in this place. Meridian secure, the Archon beaten. That's a damn good job, Ryder. Apex is planning a tribute. A statue? <laughs> they don't do statues. Just to hope it's a new victory cocktail and not a filthy marching song. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Correct. What's up? Talk to you later, Davis. I'll be here. I'm worried about this place if you can't find you. Picking Morta took guts, Ryder. Thanks for giving us Krogan a seat at the table. It was you helping the Krogan colony smuggle resources back onto the station, wasn't it? We Krogan are a hardy lot. We probably could have managed just fine on our own. In the short term. Long term, it's in our best interest that the station, and those on it, survive. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. Pathfinder. Something you want, Pathfinder? I am legendarily busy thanks to you and Morda. How is the Ambassador working out? 
There have been some tables flipped in anger, and in celebration, and seemingly completely at random. Still, it's worth it for Tan's continued blanching. Solarians can get very pale. So, what can I do for you? Director Addison. Goodbye, Pathfinder. Yes, Pathfinder. Another time. Pathfinder. Ryder, I... I am in awe. Meridian found and the Archon no more. The vision of the Initiative is taking root, thanks to you. The work isn't finished. We still have a lot to do. Yes, I understand. No time to rest. Reiko would be happy. Not satisfied, but happy. Nice talking with you, Hager. And with you, Ryder. Any logistics updates are due with Meridian is a signature victory. Your victory. Superbly done, Ryder. Those Asari Huntresses helped us out. Thank you. Any time, though I doubt we'll see another spectacle like that for a while. Good luck, Sarissa. On to glory, Ryder. Hi, Ryder. Colonial Affairs, please advise Director Tan of your staff. How are things going with Arc Lucinia? Ryder, I won't pretend I'm not disappointed. I'd hoped your choice for Ambassador would go... differently. I called it as I saw it. Yes, but... a Krogan? Morda? Empowered? I... we... I... cannot... Uh, I do not... I... Let's not talk about it. Did you have some other business? That's all. Thanks for your time. My pleasure. I see great things in our future. There's a new task because we hit 100% viability? It is a significant milestone, Pathfinder. Preparations have been made for some time. I need to know if there's another expectation because of this. Updating objectives. You have a high priority destination. At Habitat 7? What's going on? I have been instructed to not reveal mission parameters. Don't be late, Pathfinder. So, back at Habitat 7. What am I supposed to see, and what's it got to do with 100% viability? I'm getting initiative signals, magnetosphere charges, and atmosphere probes. The vault here remains non-functional, but with 100% viability to invest, we've begun terraforming this world with initiative technology. The good old-fashioned hard way. It'll eventually be a home too, thanks to you. Back where we started. Fitting. There is one more item, Pathfinder. Opening channels to the Nexus. Meridian. Podromos. Detaon. Tevuni. New Tachanka. And Initiative Allies. By unanimous vote, this world is to be renamed. Habitat 7 is now listed astronomically as Rider 1. Your world, Pathfinder. Their future. <laughs>